from Tampa Bay Streaming News Leader. This is ABC Action News. Hello, I'm Isabel Rosales. Jason has Florida's most accurate forecast in just a moment. But first, here are your ABC Action News Now headlines. The state reports more than 8,300 new coronavirus cases overnight. The virus also killing 29 more Floridians. The Health Department's coronavirus dashboard shows more than 141,000 cases, and of those, more than 138,000 are Floridians who tested positive. More than 14,000 people have had to be hospitalized, and more than 3,400 people in total have died from the virus. Here's a closer look at the cases in the Bay Area of the more than 1,700 cases. Hillsboro has 787 cases, Pinellas 306, and Polk 257 cases. No other county in our area had more than 100 cases on Saturday. Happening Monday, Pinellas County will open up a new COVID-19 testing site at Tropicana Field. It is first come, first served, starting at 7 in the morning. But they are encouraging you to bring a referral from your doctor because that could help you get processed faster. Jason. Expect another hot one in the forecast as we head through your Monday. Temperatures nearing records once again into the mid 90s, lower 90s at the coast, and there will be a couple of scattered showers and thunderstorms, but those chances are staying on the low side. Notice Futurecast gives us a slight shower chance at the coast in the morning, and then as the sea breeze continues to push northeast inland, it will give us a bit of an increase in that rain chance in the afternoon for those of you east of I-75. Most of you, though, avoiding the rain, we won't really see an uptick in the rain chances until the middle and end of the week.